Alright everybody, so I ended up having to do a part two to the last video uh, that I was uh, doing about my current uh, model car projects that I have in the works. Once again, this is your big homie Big Stan. And uh, I wasn't able to squeeze everything into the last video due to uh, my phone uh, won't, will only will, will only allow me to record like six minutes of footage for some reason right now. I'm thinking it might be a, a storage issue or something like that, but I'm going to try to get it situated and resolved uh, as quick as I can. But in the meantime, uh, here's where I am with uh, all of my projects. Uh, here's the 58 that I started. I guess about a year ago, I've only been able to uh, get as far as uh, priming it, doing the uh, silver base, and laying the color. I haven't sanded it and did any clear anything to it, but it's going to be a pretty nice project once I'm done with it. Can't say when I'm going to be finished with it, but I'd like to be done with it before the MCMA showdown in Dallas uh, in 2019 next March. And uh, here's my 63. It's going to be a fully functional uh, custom convertible. And I'm actually going to do uh, like a reverse thing with the ice cube cars. Uh, this one here is going to be the 63 with the today was a good day uh, candy green paint job. In which that'll bring me over here to the 64. That's going to be uh, Boys in the Hood. The Boys in the Hood Champagne Gold color. Okay, it's also going to be fully functional. You know, going to have a lot of detail and everything. I've been trying to step my game up, like I said in the last video. You know, being that I'm a member of LGK. And this is, uh, excuse me, LUGK. And uh, I've been a member for five years now. So I'm just really trying to come back out and, you know, uh, just bring out some more up-to-date projects, you know, something that'll display my my skills and everything that I've picked up over the years since, like I said, the last time y'all got any videos from me. And please excuse me for any mistakes or whatever uh, as far as my speaking and, and things like that goes, man. It's been a while since I've just really had to do a lot of talking on camera or whatever and I'm just trying to make sure I get everything squares into this video because I don't know how much time I'm going to be able to film but here's another project uh, my 60 Chevy Impala it's fully functional it's already wired up cut and everything uh, I just gotta really just go in go in there and do everything to finish it up uh, shout out to my man Torres uh, he's the one that, that's uh, responsible for doing that that setup for me and uh here's my what's going to be the 86 regal as you can see i cut a cut a roof in it and i'm thinking i'm going to go ahead and cut the trunk and try to do something with that trunk that's the uh 350 engine that's going to go in and i i even uh put some uh ls side mirrors on it just to be different and I was going to jack it up and hop it, but my battery's dead. So we'll just have to catch that on down the road. And then here's a project that I did like five years ago with uh, Mr. Art Taro. Everybody knows who that is. And everybody knows this car right here, the Game Breaker. It's hit the uh, show circuit in Dallas quite a bit. I actually won a trophy with it the first time I entered. I won not a trophy but a plaque earlier this year. And I'm going to come back and do a video just on this car right here, you know, and uh, some other cars that uh, that y'all seen that I didn't get a chance to just really uh, go over a lot of details about in the first video. And then here's my four-door my four door Broham. I started on this here about five years ago. Again, I, I painted it with the uh, House of Color 
I can't remember which, I think it's tangerine orange, and then I did like a, a well, tangerine orange over pagan gold is what is what the color is, and then I I started shooting some, some flake on it, but I got to go back and just, you know, do some of everything to it also, but again, I just want to give you guys an update on everything that I got going on. And uh, with that being said, I want to give a shout out to uh, my man Eddie Block and uh, all the other homies, man, that, that does the muscle cars because y'all inspired me to do the muscle car projects uh, along with job performance once again. Big shout out to my LUGK fam out there. Uh, just to all the model car builders everywhere. You know what I'm saying? I just want y'all to know, man, it ain't nothing but love. And just keep on doing your thing with these model cars. And until the next time, it's your big homie. Big stand. Oh, wait a minute. Matt 1989 cars. Big shout out to you too, bro. And uh, be on the lookout for my Transformers video because I actually picked up that hobby as well. Uh, you know, just collecting Transformers about a year ago. I know a lot of people's been waiting on that. But in the meantime, until the next one, it's your big homie, Big Stan, signing off. Saying y'all already know what it is, and y'all already know what it do. Oh, Ralph, my brother, can't leave you out. All right, we out of here, baby. Oh, I almost forgot. Yeah!